Devon. What? Raheem Devon is here, everybody. Yeah, what up, what up, what up, Raheem what up, what Devon. What up, what up, Come on now. Yeah. Look at me. I didn't got all excited. You just sat down and been here just talking about Raheem. It's all good. Damn it. I ain't gonna lie. And listen, you do look not to. You look young, cuz that's crazy. Nah, thank you. Yeah, man, I thought you, you were a new young, artist. I, I swear to God. I try to take. I mean, well, you know, I am. Every time I come out, good. you know, what I mean, in my mind, that's the mindset. You know, you gotta constantly reinvent yourself. You know, what I mean, I waited. I waited 19 years to be in my season. So good, good. So Raheem, go ahead. Good. I was gonna say you always call me a child in uh -huh. the studio. You be like, you're like a kid. You act like you're 12, 11 year old. She always makes fun of me. She well, calls me my son Gino, but I think it keeps me young. Part David. of the gift, yeah. Part of that is being, you know, being connected to your inner child, stay in love with the inner child in you. You know what I mean? Yeah. Right. Like you know, Raheem, not the not the trauma. I like you know that. What I mean? yeah. Raheem Devon. All right. So you still here? You said how many years you been in this uh, game? Man, you know, next year will be the 20 year anniversary of my first album, <sighs> The Love Experience. Yeah. Congratulations. Wow. Wow, yeah, yeah, for real. So here oh I am, gosh. you know, one 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 Grammy, you know, um, win. Shout out to Jay Ivy, you know, be, being part of his project this year. Um, three other nominations, you know, countless BET awards, different, you know, we here we are again, BET, yep. BET 2024. And, um, yeah, man, I mean, you know, I got a top 10 record right now in the Urban AC format. Just headed for number one. Go ahead. Let's fall in love. It's been on the charts for, um, I've, been top, I've been top 10 for like that, the last seven Dang. weeks. And been on the chart for 22 weeks, so. Hey. Yeah, but okay. Yeah, and and I'm, and I'm fully independent by the way. That's great. Now, that. see, let me clap yeah. it up for that because we were just having that conversation about the way the music industry has changed, with then with streaming, streaming yeah. and everything else, it's become a little harder for artists just yeah. to make money. Well, well if y'all want to make money, for the artists that want to make money, y'all want to make money, or y'all want to make money, go to even.biz. That's where you make the money at. Really? As an independent artist. Really? Even.biz. Trust dot me biz. when I tell you, even.biz, huh. that's where you want to go. You know, put out your singles, put out your projects, um, create create a, create a nice campaign for your for your super fans, and I'm pretty certain that they'll go, they'll go there and support you. Like like, and, and, and what you'll find is making a dollar, two dollars, three dollars a stream versus you know the zero point zero three. It sounds a lot more fruitful. Look at that. And that don't mean you got to be anti DSPs, but you got to just know how to work the machine and right. make it work for you. And you have to. You know what I mean? I so, you shouldn't be, so in my, in my opinion, right now, if you're an artist, you shouldn't be putting out any music without putting it out to even first and then going to the DSPs okay. maybe later on. And it's going to give you all the analytics that you need. I can give you countless reasons as to why I like it's that. beneficial I like that because, wait, real quick, you're helping so artists so out. So you're so helping good. these artists out Absolutely. that are yeah. listening. So, thank you for that. Go ahead. Yeah. And I also say, if you make music just to make money, yeah, please follow it as a business because that's a well, business. Well, right? well, it's like, cause I, art, I what, feel like what, you could just love. But here's it. the thing: you should never do anything for the pat for the money. Absolutely, that's what that's I heard. A, that's a, you know what I'm saying. So, like, if if you are one of those artists that just doing it for the money, quit now. Really? Yeah, I'm just saying because like it's going because what, what it's a changing of the guard. Yep. Yep. And and and, and yeah. it's always been that, but the culture is going to always dictate. But you have sometimes lucky one, one hit wonders who do for and, the money. And you should, make and, yeah, some and, you, and you should, and you should, and you, and you should want to, you should, you should, but you should want to make money. But the way to do it is, to, you know, you gotta. Longevity. The business model is constantly changing mm -hmm. and evolving. You know what I mean? Yeah, so sure, you could even be part of, you could even be part of the problem or the solution. You know what I mean? So you know, um, so it's a, yeah, so it's about evolving and you know, you know, and even it's been, I've been using this since the top of the year. It's mm -hmm. been pr been proven to be fruitful. Um, for me as an artist, and I still utilize the DSPs too in a manner where you know I can monetize them in both. Yeah, but, yeah, for sure. but I'm not putting that. You know, I, I'm able to see analytics. I'm able. I'm able to know what like re what record to go to with radio. What's the record I want to put wow. some promo behind? That's great. Just you know, I get a mailing list. I, I'm able to connect with the fan directly. Just do you know all while using the platform. Technology has allowed for oversaturation, but it also has allowed for artists to have more power with their own art. You have more control that of it too. to a well, certain degree. Well, some some right? you know, some people might argue, right? I think that I think that subscription base, that's that's the idea of subscription base uh, platforms has kind of tarnished uh. the culture. Mm. You know what I'm saying? I mean, it's, it's it's made you it's made you it's made you not work s smarter, but it's made you work harder because wow. you have somebody that you take Spotify for example, or any of these platforms. Um, where, where even even a Patreon, for example, where you can say, hey, you tell your fans, your super fans, pay thirty dollars a month, and mm. that's all you gotta pay, and then you put out like all, then you working to put out all this music, all this content, which you pay for, mm. the mixing and matching the records, you gotta pay for that. A videography, you gotta yeah, pay man. for that. Mm. Um, you know, uh, um, um, marketing promotion, you gotta yeah, pay for that. Man. So, and 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 there's only there's only really like two major distributors now. If you've been really following what's wow. going on with the culture, and yeah, I yeah, think yeah, both of sure. them are owned by the wow. same handler, and that's messed up. So that's a monopoly. You know what I mean? So yeah, so so 
So you're not, so you're really like, you know, and and ain't and labels ain't giving no money out. Like they're so, trying to figure out how to how to, you know, the, you know the deal now. That I I have an artist friend right now who I'm mm. mentoring, and the deal that she was offered was basically they want twenty percent of the pie. Oh wow! They're not offering no money, and their whole and their whole persona is like, you know. We'll get you on some playlist and whatever, but you got to prove yourself. Prove yourself wow. for what? You better off doing it on your, on your own. own. Yep. At that point, you know yep. what I mean? Yep. Like, yeah. you know what I mean? So, you know, this was a, this for me. This was a big, big year because this was the first time I was able to, um, you know, bet on myself as right. it as it relates That's to terrestrial radio. Yeah. Yeah. You know, be like like do it terrestrial radio and like, but it, but it, but it's but it took time. You know what I'm saying? Like I built what I built over you know 20 years yeah. you know yeah, yeah, and 15 right, years right, of it right. being independent you right. know what i mean yeah yeah Do you you know what it is because when when someone mentions raheem devon you know what i'm already thinking i'm i'm thinking a vibe a mood a real singer yeah a guy who's been in the game for a while yeah you you're thinking of like oh he made it yeah, yeah. to a certain but degree you, but right? you're yeah. now learning you had to relearn and like you're saying things are changing and everything else what do you think what is the number one song everybody wants to hear you sing by the way right now probably let's fall in love yeah like that's you know and, and, which is which is which is the Isley brother remake by okay. the way mm -hmm. but it's a but it's a whole new generation that doesn't even know that you know what I mean mm -hmm. like you know so for the ones that do you know what I mean they understand that I'm preserving the culture by going and taking a classic that. like that and putting my rendition on it you know but then there's records like woman customer yep you know don't come easy um, you know, I got, I got, I got, I got albums. Though. I got a catalog. I got, I know you know, it. You know I know what I mean? like, you know. And you haven't sold it yet. Yeah, you can put nah. I, you I ain't, ain't selling. My you ain't selling your catalog. Yeah. He said he ain't yeah, but, yeah. but if you were to sell it, you wouldn't be able to perform "Woman" again, or, or nah. I mean, I don't know. I don't know the particulars of it. Like, uh -huh. I just know that that's that. You know, it's you know that that that's something that I would like to. I would like to leave that to the trust or. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Good for you. You, you, have have children, yeah, you have children. You know, publishing feeds your family, Look family, you. family. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? So okay. Yeah, Lorraine, I mean, you you know this business now, don't yeah, you? So, you know, I mean, but but to, but to each his own. You know what I mean? Now. Yeah, yeah. We'll work for. But some, you're, but you're I got an offer. I can't artists. refuse. That's a, that's a different company. You know, we'll I, work with, for somebody yeah. else. Might not work. Yeah, but he's yeah. educating a lot of folks. It really who it really ba it really is based on the terms and the deals. You know what I mean? Like, am I selling it for ten years and then I retain it back? You know, am I leasing it? Like, you know, it really just depends on 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 you know. What about what about a tour real, real quick. I know they're getting ready to take you, but real quick, are you touring and everything else? When I just I just knocked out a 19 city tour with Lettucey. Um, shout out to Gilead Sciences, you know, um, which 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 we you know we had a partnership for that. Um, the deals, you know, that speaks on you know the statistics of HIV and AIDS and how it's affecting Black women in mm -hmm. the country mm -hmm. and Black girls, the transgender community as well. Um, I'm also, you know, I'm, I just put out a live album on Even Dot Biz, the first nice. day of summer. Oh, there it is. Yeah, Even yeah, Biz. Yeah, you know, you know what I mean? Live album. And, yeah, and, and, um, and, and I'm working. I got a lot of music that's going to be flooding the DSPs. I'm doing a lot of strategic partnerships with artists. Uh -huh. Raheem Devon presents different oh, yeah. artists. Right. You know what I mean? That's like the thing. The fact that he just snuck in here. Everybody like, think oh, about Raheem. it because he just but like. I, I could tell that you weren't. You didn't know. Who I wasn't sure because <laughs> I was like, I'm going, okay, now <laughs> I'm thinking he's a new artist that's tripping me out. I'm happy for you. Happy to see now, you. Thank Glad you, yeah, you stopped yeah, by. Yeah, yeah, I'll come back again. Um, yeah, for sure. Oh my gosh. And let us know when you're going back out on another tour. Oh, absolutely. Well, 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 now, you know, again, the 20 year anniversary of the Love Experience is next year. So keep your eyes and your ears peeled for the Love Experience tour, which is happening in 2025. You know, the nostalgic first album that I put out. And um, yeah, man. We, I'm sure that. we'll be back. I, I, I also you. think Thank Fly you. should share with Fly. Let me know where you got that. Oh uh, man, shout out to my man Barry, my tailor Barry, out of, out of DC, I man. Do, I, I gotta yeah. get yeah. one. Yeah. You have on your whole everything. Yeah, yeah, All right, yeah, brother from the motherland, man. Raheem Devon, everybody. Love life, love life. It's Didi in the morning. Yeah.